If you plan on heading down the road in an all-electric vehicle or plug-in hybrid from Lexus, you'll also need to know how to charge it. This can either be done at home or in public. EV charging centers around three charging levels, each of which determines the equipment and location needs, as well as the time it takes to charge. Basic level one charging is convenient, as it runs off 120 volts from a standard wall outlet and requires no additional hardware, but it also means significantly longer charge times. That's why many owners prefer to upgrade their home with a level two setup, faster charging. To do this, a licensed electrician is needed since it requires a 240 volt power source, like those used by larger appliances, such as clothes dryers, as well as the purchase and installation of a home charging station. Level two charging is also commonly found at public stations. Additionally, you can access level three DC fast charging stations in public as well. Level 3 isn't viable for residential use, but under ideal conditions, it can be the fastest option, providing direct current that skips the typical AC-DC onboard conversion step. When it comes to home charging, the process is fairly straightforward. Start by making sure you're parked with the vehicle's charging port within range of the charge source. For regular level 1 charging, plug the charge cable into the wall outlet. Most EVs come equipped with this level one cable, which is stored in the vehicle's cargo area. If your power source is a level two charger, simply remove the charge connector from the charging station. Now, whether level one or two, insert the connector into the inlet, ensuring that it clicks into place. A light will come on to indicate that charging has begun. If a specific charging schedule has been set, however, the vehicle will charge at the scheduled times instead. In this case, simply select Charge Now if you need to override the schedule and begin charging immediately. From here, you can monitor the charge progress, either through the vehicle's indicator light, its multi-information display, or remotely through the Lexus app. Just make sure your Lexus account and vehicle are linked and showing in the app, and that you are enrolled in an active Remote Connect trial or subscription. Additionally, you can set a schedule so that charging occurs at specific times, like when electricity rates may be lower. When the app or vehicle indicates that charging is complete, you're ready to hit the road. Of course, you can also stop charging at any time if need be. Getting a full charge isn't necessary. When using a level one charger, unplug it from the outlet and return the cable to your vehicle's cargo area. If using a level two charger, Simply remove and replace the connector back on the charging station. Charging at a public station is a similar process, but you'll need to consider location and payment. Aside from making it easy to monitor charging status, the Lexus app is great for finding nearby stations based on distance and available charge type, including if level three fast charging is offered. It's also worth considering how long you'll need to be parked there and which amenities might be nearby. Once you've found a spot and ensured the charging port is facing the charger, simply walk up to the station and follow the instructions on the screen. The payment process varies across different stations. Some stations request a payment method up front, while others do so after you have completed charging. Payment can usually be made with a credit card, an account-based app, on your mobile device or through the Lexus app. In cases where customers are using stations that are part of Lexus's approved partner networks. Using a level two charger, the process is the same as home charging. Simply insert the connector and go. If a DC fast charging station and a level three charger is available, the process here is similar as well. Although the lower DC connector port will be used. Please note that whether level two or three, the station's connector design and compatibility can vary, so be sure to reference the owner's manual to ensure your hardware is compatible. When charging in public or at a shared residential space, you can make use of charge connector lock settings for added peace of mind. These can be accessed from the vehicle's settings menu. Just look for the charging connector lock option. First, the auto lock setting means the charge connector will automatically engage the lock when you plug in. 
but it will not disengage until you unlock the vehicle. Next, with Auto Lock and Auto Unlock, the vehicle will automatically lock the charger when inserted, as well as automatically unlock it once charging is complete. This setting is especially convenient in areas where you don't want to tie up a charge plug once you're done charging. When the setting is off, the charge connector must be manually locked and unlocked. Visit Lexus.com electrified to learn more about Lexus's electrified lineup and see how easy getting into and owning a Lexus all-electric vehicle or plug-in hybrid can be.